Hey everyone, how's it going? This is the time to rage here today with just a quick video doing a tip that not everyone really knows about and that is first of all, this Kakuna, very weak um, I really hope this is worth catching <laughs> but anyways, what we're going to talk about is um, spin catching which is something that not everyone does, even though it can get you some pretty good XP. So how you do it is you take your thumb, like such, or your finger, whatever you use, hold on to the Pokeball, and then you move it in a circular motion. And you move it faster, and you'll start to see that after a little bit it starts to glow. In which case, you want to read which way the spin is going. So I'm spinning it counterclockwise, therefore I'm going to want to flick to the right. Like that, however, you don't want to um, do it at that time. And you'll also notice that if you try to go like to the side like that too quickly, then it will cancel out. So you want to go at sort of a 45 degree angle. <laughs> anyway, it's not the best throw. I don't know if it'll catch it or not. But you will also see that in the end, there is an XP boost. You see the curveball right there. Which, I know right now you might be thinking, Rage, it's really not, it's really not all that much. And you're right. You're completely right. But for someone that's my level, which is 13, you know, that's pretty low by some people's standards. And every XP point that you get can help. At the same time, the curveball rates go up if you were to use something like a Great Ball, for instance, versus a Pokeball. They also go up based off of if you hit an Excellent, or if you hit a Perfect, or a Nice, and all those sort of things that all come together to add to the XP boost. So anyways guys, if you liked the video, feel free to leave a like a comment, or even subscribe if you're feeling generous. It really helps me going. I'm Time to Rage, and I'm signing out. Peace.